Bowl first is the decision. The crowd will be hoping for their batters to get off to a good start. Oh, it's a loud crowd as the players make their way out. Some really strong players on both sides, capable of scoring quick runs, big hits, and the bowlers, they'll be looking to take quick wickets. The pitch, that should provide a fantastic contest. Opening ball coming up. Here we go with the first ball of the match. Nothing better than getting a match started and hearing the sound of Leather on Willow. Massive outside edge. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Great shorter ball. Well played, though. Didn't flinch and was able to leave the ball comfortably. That's the end of the short stuff for this over. Goes over the top with that shot. Threaded it through brilliantly. All timing on that shot. A uh, good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball. It'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Square cut, finds point, no run. but it drops safely. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on a length is obviously the way to go. Head over the ball, great shot. That's racing away. Well, didn't time that at all, but managed to get it away to the boundary. End of the over, nine runs coming from it. The Invincibles are nine for none. End of the first and an exceptional start. Some big shots early on. Can build some momentum easily off that over. A lot of pressure coming to the crease. Not had the best of weeks leading up to this game. So I want to show everyone their strength. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. Edged. Got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. Nearly gets the edge. Wong with a great delivery there. Oh, that's been heaved away and punished over the rope. That's a brute of a maximum. That's a brilliantly timed shot off the back foot. It just flew to the boundary for six. End of the over. Eight off it. The Invincibles, 17 for nine. They're setting themselves for a big power play. The right arm pace bowler is coming into the attack from the pavilion end. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Oh, that's a great shot early on. Wide of cover, and that'll give her a bit of confidence early on. May just pull up short of the boundary, though. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot.
What a lovely shot, and it flew to the boundary. That's clearly not the type of delivery to be bowling. Bates is starting to really get on top of this bowl. He may need a few changes to hold the momentum. Can't get that outside the ring field. The whole team's gone up here. What's the umpire going to say? End of the third over. The overall invincibles are now in five in. Arlott from the pavilion end. Straight to the fielder. Wow, that's missed a lot. That's got a flight number attached to it. That ball has gone a long, long way. Just missed the line. Not the worst delivery, but that was dispatched with interest. Everyone just watched that in awe. Might look to go big again here. Wide of extra cover and away goes the ball to the boundary. We can't hit the ball much better than that. Timed it to perfection. End of the over, 10 off it. The Invincibles, 35 for none. The right arm medium bowler is coming into the attack from the voxel end. Finds the fielder with that shot. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. Finds the edge. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. End of the over, five runs coming from it. The Invincibles, 40 for none. Batters are set, and they're maintaining their excellent start so far. A new bowler is coming into the attack. A new bowler into the attack for Birmingham Phoenix. Massive outside edge. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder.
Punch down the ground. Mid off and mid on in pursuit. Picked up four with a lovely shot off the front foot. Five runs added in the over. The Invincibles are 45 for none. Perry back on now. Luis Perry into the attack for Birmingham Phoenix. That was a boundary the moment the ball left the bat. Can't time that any better. Perfection. The last one helped the scoring rate, making their intentions for this innings. Glanced away nicely, but fine short, fine leg. The bowler looks really confident. Well, the end of an entertaining performance with the bat. Certainly a good wicket to get. Those runs were really starting to flow. The field will come up now, you'd think. Pressure should be on as the new batter strides to the middle. They'll be looking for another quick wicket. Doesn't beat the infield. End of the over, five off it. The Invincibles are 50 for one. They've got busy working the ball around and hitting boundaries in between. It's a good setup for a strong finish. Perry from the pavilion end. Massive edge, misses everyone, and that's racing away. Nearly got through them, just got onto it in time, and with enough bat speed to pick up four. Can't afford to go too full again. It does help to switch up your deliveries, just to keep them guessing. Was quick onto that in the infield. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. Well, that one's for the textbook. Stands tall on top of the bounce and a lovely flick of the wrist at the end. Perry has kept the pressure on in this over. Just needs to maintain the momentum going forwards. Drive straight down the ground. mid on will collect that one, though. Beautifully struck right out of the guts and all the way. Managed to get onto the front foot early and just incredible power to loft it over the boundary rope. That last ball isn't something you want to repeat of. You don't want to be giving away easy runs. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder.
What a great shot that was. Onto the front foot really quickly. No stopping that one. I'd like to see them just aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. End of the over, a big one. 11 runs coming from it. The Invincibles are 69 for one. That was a beautiful shot. Rocks onto the back foot and stabs the ball away. Fielders had no chance. How will she reply? Massive outside edge. Misses everything. End of the over. Five runs coming from it. The Invincibles are 74 for one. They've got busy working the ball around and hitting boundaries in between. It's a good setup for a strong finish. The right armour is coming on to bowl from the pavilion end. Thick edge. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Great shot. Pulled straight to backward square leg, though. Couldn't get it through the field. Massive edge, misses everyone, and that's racing away. Capsi has gotten the big shot away this over. Now they can focus on playing the next ball on its merits. End of the over. Six runs coming from it. The Invincibles are 80 for one. End of the 11th over. The Oval Invincibles are now on 80 for one. Flintoff coming on, obviously hoping the pace will cause some trouble. Heaved over the top, and that'll be a maximum fantastic square drive. Well, that's just timed brilliantly. Moves closer to 50, going to need something special to get the wicket. Perry, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. Beats the outside edge. Good bowling there. The 
The gap was left open for them and they were happy to oblige. Picked it early, got into position well and punched it to the boundary. The boundary last delivery, is that the sign they're trying to push the run rate? Bowling fielders look really confident. Yeah, just might be a bit of a suspect review by the batter. I can't see this getting overturned. Was there a bat on it? Fielders think there was. This could be trouble. Now, I didn't pick up on anything there. Very close to the bat, though. Capsi, quite confident with the challenge. You can just tell from the body language, pretty confident, and they're going to get a second chance. Going with spin now. One for one. Eddie Levy into the attack for Birmingham Phoenix. A oh, fantastic catch. Straight to cover point for an easy catch. The trudge back to the pavilion. A disappointing display in the end for someone with such batting skills. This one goes down as a fail. A difficult period as they come to the wicket. They'll take plenty of time to settle themselves in before facing their first ball. Flex that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Onto the front foot, super shot, should be four. Yeah, too wide, it was there to be hit, and it was really given the treatment. A good innings, that's 50. A simple raise of the bats, thumbs up to their batting partner, and they're ready to go again. Just need to keep it simple. Line and length, around about off stump. That'll force a mistake. Can't get that outside the ring field. That's the over. The Invincibles are 97 for two. Been some really good overs strung together. They've taken some risks, along with some good running. A very good total is on the way. Now on seven for two. The right armour is coming into the attack from the voxel end. Two straight, it's just been helped on its way for a maximum. Fine shot there. Well, enough leverage there to get a good swing of the arms under it to get it over the rope. Getting nice and settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder.
Finds the fielder with that shot. End of the over. Nine runs coming from it. The Invincibles are 106 for two. Mark Sood from the pavilion end. Brilliant shot there. Hit that one on the up. A fabulous drive for six. This delivery just needs to be pitched up on a length. Too short, and you're going to get punished on this pitch. Oh, that's gone a mile. That could go out of the ground. Get the fielders into the crowd. Two on the trot. Well, that's a waste of a delivery. Absolutely no trouble getting onto it and dispatching it for six. Drilled that one away. Caress that nicely through the gap to the boundary. A uh, good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball. It'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Wow, that's missed the lot. Got that away nicely. End of the over. 20 runs coming from it. The Invincibles, 126 for two. End of the 15th over. The batting team are now on 126 for two. Flintoff into the attack now from the pavilion end. No, no, no. Terrible shot. Crash! Beautiful bowling. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. Coming to the wicket, they'll be looking to play within the V early and expand as they get settled. Great shorter ball. Well played, though. Didn't flinch and was able to leave the ball comfortably. That's the end of the short stuff for this over. Villiers taking guard. Has been playing really well in recent matches. Certainly needs to bring their A game today. Oh, there you go. A no ball. Maybe just trying a little too hard. Just need to get more control back. They're going to go in for the kill with this delivery. It's up to the new batter to make sure the fielding side doesn't pick up any more momentum. Wax the free hit away. The fielder coming around to cut it off, perhaps. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. End of the over, five off it. The Invincibles are 131 for three. Been some really good overs strung together. They've taken some risks, along with some good running. A very good total is on the way. Massive outside edge. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on a length is obviously the way to go.
square cut, finds point, no run. Devine ends what has been a tidy over, just needed to top it off with a wicket. Mark Sood from the Vauxhall end. Straight drive, mid-off will cut that one off. Was quick onto that in the infield. End of the over, two runs added. The Invincibles are 136 for three. Perry has been going really well here, comes back on from the pavilion end. Into the attack for Birmingham Phoenix. Dealt with that beautifully. Saw the short one and got out of the way. No more of those in this over. I oh, thought that was passing, but a fantastic dive to cut it off. Too good. That is huge. Jumped all over the slower ball. Only gave them more time to see it and make sure of it. I'd like to see them just aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Straight to the fielder. Things have been kept relatively quiet here. Another good over comes to an end. There was some wonderful stroke play on offer for the fans here. Bowlers just weren't tight enough. Levick to finish this innings. Into the attack for Birmingham Phoenix. Doesn't beat the infield. Nice shot, straight gully. Dives and takes a very good catch. What a catch. As they head back to the pavilion, they'll be wishing they went about this innings a little differently. Not too much to speak of on the scoreboard. The new batter always likes to feel bad on ball as they bring a bit of nervous energy to the wicket. Please make it welcome.
time that perfectly. Well, that's what you pay your entrance money for. It's flown into the crowd. A brilliant shot off the front foot. No need to move. Yeah, it can be very disheartening seeing good delivery smacked around. Sometimes, though, you've just got to accept it and move on. Six of your finest, please. Cover drive for a maximum. Brilliant. Well, that just shows how difficult life can be as a bowler. Lifts the ball off a good length. A fabulous bit of timing for six. Bowler needs to tighten up a bit. Oh, and again, three in a row. We're seeing some brutal power on display at the moment. Six, six, six. They've got three in a row now. Fabulous power, fabulous timing too. And the innings comes to an end. The Phoenix will need 163 runs. This is a very defendable total. The openers will need to get their eye in very quickly and get the scoreboard ticking over if they have any chance. Here we go. First ball. delivery and you don't pass up chances like that crushed away for four how will the bowler respond couldn't get it through the field Yeah, big opportunity. They've worked really hard in recent weeks. They should have the confidence to build in innings and get a big score on the board. Cuts that off well in the infield. Just open the face of the bat really well. That's through the infield. There'll be four more. The gap was left open for them and they were happy to oblige. Picked it early, got into position well, and punched it to the boundary. Van Nieke, the right armour, is coming into the attack from the voxel end.
Drive straight down the ground. Mid-on will collect that one, though. Does very well to quickly get across to this one. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Pinged off the bat. Just missed the line. Not the worst delivery, but that was dispatched with interest. Everyone just watched that in awe. Six last ball. How will the bowler reply? Can't get that outside the ring field. Six runs out of there. The Phoenix, 15 for none. End of the Billiards coming into the attack from the pavilion end. The new bowler into the attack. Swept away but finds the fielder. Stuff open the shoulder and lofted that over cover. That'll be six more. How easy was that? A pickup drive all the way for six. Clicks that one simple as you like inside the ring. Finds the fielder with that shot. End of the over. Seven off it. The Phoenix, 22 for none. End of the fourth over. Gray, the pace bowler, coming into the attack. Eva Gray, the new bowler, into the attack for the Oval Invincibles. Huge shot. That's a massive shot. Just incredible. Well, enough leverage there to get a good swing of the arms under it to get it over the rope. Don't always mind getting hit for runs. What's important, just focus on getting the next delivery right. but it drops safely. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Wow, that's missed the lot. Enormous, massive, gigantic. Take your pick. Hit that one on the arc. A fabulous drive for six. Over. The Phoenix, 35 for none. Four gone in the power play, and we've seen some excellent running between the wickets and good shot making with a little sprinkle of luck as well, of course. Nicely fielded out deep on the boundary.
Oh my, that's racing away. There was a gap there and pulled away with conviction to the boundary. A uh, good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball. It'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Too good. That is huge. Well, that ball has been hit. It's flown into the crowd. To get that much power coming forward onto the front foot is just ridiculous. Going with pace now. Missed the line, not the worst delivery, but that was put away with interest. Langston back into the attack. And now on three, Finland. Beth Langston, the new bowler, into the attack for the Oval Invincibles. And gone. Deep point needed to move around a fair bit and has taken a wonderful catch. Oh, great work. Held their nerve while the ball was in the air. And they've taken a good catch. That was a blistering knock right on top of the bowling. Tried once too many times. The show ends, but they'll receive a warm reception from the crowd. First ball for the batter coming in. Edged it. Good bowling in that over. Just the one from it. The Phoenix, 54 for one. They were just a bit flat after the power play. They came out hard, and I think they really need to keep up that mentality for the back half of the innings. Langston from the pavilion in. That is huge, enormous, massive, gigantic. Take your pick. You give that much width and you are asking for trouble. 
That was so well timed, it flew over the boundary. How will she reply? Good catch out. Well, this is a fantastic wicket. Kept the runs down, really didn't get settled and looked to be in trouble for most of the knock. Now, yeah, great opportunity to prove the critics wrong. Certainly needs to build an innings for the team. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Quick onto that in the infield. Oh wow, that is out of here. That could be out of the ground. The runs are starting to come now. Really good shot for six. This innings is starting to build. Langston getting a wicket in that over. Really good bowling. There wasn't much on offer for the batters. Right, outside edge, but it'll be safe and another boundary. The bowler is in disbelief on that one. Flashed at it, didn't time it well, but got enough to get it to the boundary. Can she come back with a dot ball? Drive straight down the ground, mid on will click that one though. Edged. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on a length is obviously the way to go. Doesn't beat the infield. Oh, 
onto that early. That could be four. Five runs added in the over. The Phoenix are 80 for two. They've got busy working the ball around and hitting boundaries in between. It's a good setup for a strong finish. Billiards coming back into the attack. Great shot, through the gap. Couldn't get it through the field. Head was completely still, and they struck that hard, high, and long for six. Well, that's a waste of a delivery. Absolutely no trouble getting onto it and dispatching it for six. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Jones waited on that and guides it down to third. Fielder coming around may stop it before the boundary. Huge, enormous, massive, gigantic. Take the pick. Just a little bit of room given, and the power was immense. That has flown over the boundary. Swept away, but finds the field. Dives and takes a nice catch. Big dive from the field, a tremendous catch. This is a great wicket to take. Just look to be building a solid innings and at a really good run rate. Perfect time to take a wicket. Lots of pressure coming into bat. We have to wait just a little bit longer to face their first ball though. Gray coming back into the attack has done well so far. The new bowler into the attack for the Oval Invincibles. Massive outside edge. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Big edge. Just got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. Finds the edge. That's gone for six. That is a huge one. Perry, there's plenty from these bowlers. Hit that so hard. Pressed forward, got the body shape right and launched it. One for the textbook. Six last ball. How will the bowler reply? Edged. End of the over. A good one in terms of keeping the batters quiet. Just needed to take a wicket to make it an excellent one. Been some really good overs strung together. They've taken some risks, along with some good running. A very good total is on the way. That's a big one, a maximum. Away she goes. If you lose the pictures, it's because it's hit the broadcast truck. 
Well, that's what you pay your entrance money for. It's flown into the crowd. A brilliant shot off the front foot. No need to move. Finds a fielder with that shot. That's out. Oh, simple run out. It's another wicket, the fourth now. Sometimes you've just got to accept that you couldn't do anything about a delivery. That's a long way to walk out there just to turn around and walk straight back. They'll just want to get this first run behind them and then push on. Big edge. Seven runs out of there. The Phoenix, 108 for four. End of the over. Birmingham and Phoenix are now on 108 for four. The bowler will continue for the next five balls. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. Still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. That's high. Is there enough on it? There is. Add that maximum to the scoreboard. Thank you very much. Too much width, really. They're only asking for that to be hammered into the stands, and that is exactly what's happened. How will the bowler respond? That's huge. That's a biggie. It is out of here. Absolutely smoked off the bat. Well, enough leverage there to get a good swing of the arms under it to get it over the rope. This delivery just needs to be pitched up on length. Too short, and you're going to get punished on this pitch. Nice shot. Cut away, running towards the boundary. That'll take some chasing. Got it away for four, but could have point very nicely. Well, that was a struggle, getting smacked all over the park. They've batted really well, this middle block of overs. They've had a perfect mix of precision and aggression, and their reward is to be well ahead of the required run rate. Billiards from the pavilion end. Over the infield with a cracking shot. Four runs. They were so still at the crease. Just a slight movement forward. Fabulous shot. Might look to go big again here. Flex that one. Simple as you like inside the ring.
Oh, my, that's racing away. End of the over, 10 runs from it. The Phoenix, 137 for four. They had a great foundation early on, and they've carried it forward to make a big total. End of the 16th over, Birmingham Phoenix are now on 137 for four. The bowler will continue for the next five balls. Nice shot, but straight to gully. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Oh, now then, that's high in the air. Batters should get a few here. That's just a brilliantly aggressive shot. Gets onto the front foot, and it's flown over the boundary. Just need to keep it simple. Line and length. Round about off stump. That'll force a mistake. Massive outside edge. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Seven runs added in that over. The Phoenix are 144 for four. This bowler knows how to give the ball an almighty tweak. Let's see how they go. Into the attack for the overall invincibles. Oh, I thought that was passing, but a fantastic dive to cut it off. No, no, no. Terrible shot. Bang. Sent back over the bowler's head. Mid off and mid on can only watch as that ball sails into the crowd. That was the kind of contact you dream of. Nothing wrong with the delivery. But boy, did it get hit. Just brilliant. Can't get that outside the ring field. Oh, wow. That is out of here. That could be out of the ground. That ball has been hit. It has flown into the crowd. To get that much power coming forward on the front foot is ridiculous. Gray from the pavilion end. Misses everything. Finds the edge. Gone! Oh, well, that's a bit unlucky. Starting to get interesting now. That's the fifth wicket, and a very frustrated person is heading back to the pavilion. With the fall of that wicket, the new batter comes charging out to the crease. They're quick to take guard and face up. Cuts that off well in the infield.
still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. Brilliant diving stop. Good bowling in that over. Just the one from it. The Phoenix, 158 for five. Well, they've maintained the intensity all innings and kept ahead of the run rate. It's been a wonderful chase by this team. Runs required, favour the batters. This needs to be very, very clean, this over, to stand any chance. Have to go for it now. They really need a boundary, this ball. Edged it. The Invincibles goes up strong, but the batter doesn't feel like got anything on that. Nicely done by the keeper. Really getting to the tail enders now. Sixth wicket gone. There's not a lot left in this lineup. New batter comes to the crease. Never an easy time to come into bat after the fall of a wicket. Lovely cover drive. Straight to the extra cover fielder. A great victory, extremely close, right to the end. And to bring the win home like that is something special. That's the end of our broadcast for now. Hope you enjoyed the match and join us again real soon.